how would you prioritize link acquisition for a blog that is specific to one country? Oh, he's got a second part of the question here. Um, would it be better? So would it be better to expand to less related niches within that country or expand to the exact niche? I'm gonna have to start over. How would how would you prioritize link acquisition for a blog that is specific to one country? Would we better expand to less related niches within that country or expand the exact niche from other countries? Not sure which one looks more out of place for links. Um, I think it's kind of going to kind of depend like what kind of website it is. Like if it's like a local like service based company type thing, like you want to say a carpet cleaner or something, you know, um, I think it's stranger for a local carpet cleaner to start getting international links from, you know, say American carpet cleaning sites. Um, not to say that they can't do anything, but it's just a, a little bit weirder, I think versus if it was like um an affiliate site or um you know informational type site or whatever uh where where you know it would just it would be a little bit more natural to get some some foreign links on a site like that um what, what would you say on this one nick well um so whenever you're going after a specific geographic region or language right um you do want links that are going to be um, local to that area, um, you do. And at the same time, like Chris said, you're going to want links that are specific to your niche. Um, so to me, whenever you're asking this question, especially the last part, not sure which one looks more out of place for the links. Whenever you've got a question like that, I think the best recourse of action for you to take as an individual, as an SEO, is to consider what is natural, right? So if I'm a carpet cleaner in the UK, and um, let's just go with local since that's what we were talking about, um, then, you know, citations, um, stuff with geographic relevance is going to play its hand. At the same time, if I'm Joe, the UK cleaning guy, and I like posting on US-based forums or I get some press where I'm known for doing some sort of cleaning that you know resonates in the US, then that is good press, good publicity as well. So naturally, it does make sense for you to get both of them. And even when I'm building an affiliate site, I'm still going to do that as well because there will be typically a geographic region that I am um, you know, more closely monitoring or trying to break into. Um, and that blending of geographic specificity and um, uh, niche uh, specificity uh, would, uh, you know, both help with, uh, you know, getting up in the SERPs. So I think it's less about which one is more important and more so, well, should I blend them? So whenever you're looking at that, it's, you know, is it worth the cost? Um, if you can get some geographic relevant backlinks for free or for really cheap, then yes, you know, go ahead and get them. That includes blog comments on geographic specific stuff, um, forums, etc. But at the same time, it works just the same for niche specific as well, right? Um, I think tying both of them in together is going to give you the best results, um, personally. And also, I don't, I don't know if Nick covered this because uh, I was kind of looking at something else for a second, but. Um, you know, when you're, when you're, if you wanted to stay within your geographic area for link acquisition, you know, I'm not really sure exactly how niche down you're trying to be when you're getting these links. Cause a lot of people seem to think that, okay, I have a website about laptops. I need links from websites that are about laptops, but like it, you do, you do not have to be that specific. Um, you know, if you think about what happens in real life, um, you know, there are, there are websites that post content about a variety of different subjects. For example, it could be technology or it could be like technology and business. Um, you know, th th you can, you can start getting like pretty like broad with stuff or like CNN, like CNN, like, you know, these huge sites that just post about literally everything. Um, and there's nothing wrong with that. Um, 
So I'm not really sure exactly how niche down you're trying to be here, and maybe that's kind of causing you some some stress with, you know, you're trying starting to look at foreign links instead of many more links that you could just acquire uh, if you kind of um, changed your uh, view on what's relevant. And yeah, sorry. Uh, so as far as what, what's relevant goes, just try to think of what happens in the real world. You know, a, a website about laptops doesn't get links only from websites about laptops or even websites that are only about computers. They get links from a wide variety of stuff. They could even get links from, um, you know, websites that are about something that you think is kind of like obscure, like maybe it's, um, what, what could link to a, a laptop? Uh, you know, something about uh, school, you know, you know, it's about school, it's about studying, it's about students, it's about buying a laptop for your kid. Um, so right. you just have to kind of try not to be as uh, anal about uh, <laughs> <laughs> about about That's funny coming from you about what's like. relevant and and just kind of try to think about uh, in a, from a more like practical standpoint but don't know if you're doing that or not but uh, just you could be and if you are maybe you could expand that a little bit um anything else to say on this one nick i guess just which um which set of links would be the best for you? Niche relevant, geographic specific, right? Like that's gonna that's gonna help yeah. you the most. So if you need a place to start, uh, find as many of those as you possibly can right up front. Hey everyone, thanks for watching. Be sure to check the links below for more info on this topic, as well as other cool stuff like SEO case studies, our Facebook community, and our link building services. And like always, please like, comment, and subscribe if you enjoyed the video. Thanks and happy ranking.